Hey guys, Ultra Rose is here. I really like the way they do this banner art now. Like they have the actual entire full like preview of the character on the banner art itself. That is pretty cool. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and take a look at the actual characters here. So we go to Z power list. Let's see how the characters are featured here. So we have Sword of Trunks, Purple Rose, nice, Vegito Blue, Vegeta. Blue Zamasu is actually back already. That's pretty quick. They usually don't bring back characters that fast. That is a really, really good inclusion on this banner, though. That Blue Zamasu. Blue Goku Black, a character I actually don't have 14 stars. I don't think I only need two copies to get him finished. Uh, Rose and Zamasu. Purple Vegeta Blue actually just did a revisit on this character. We know Trunks and Mai is about to get a Zenkai. I would not be surprised if this guy got a Zenkai at some point. This uh, green uh, transforming Goku Black. This guy is pretty good Z ability. This guy's a really good Z ability. This guy's completely terrible. This guy's also completely terrible, and that's it. Okay. Um, it's actually not a bad banner. The fact that they have the blue Zamasu one here as well. It's and then the I think purple Rose is still really good too. Um, I I can't recommend summoning on an ultra banner, right? Because just uh, it's just okay. This looks I I. I really am happy they did this. Like, look, look how sick this looks. Like, they have that actual uh, preview on. Like, that looks that looks really good. I'm re that that's a really good change that they did. Um, but I, I can't like recommend people summon on this banner. Let me just check the featured characters here. I believe it's just the LFs, right? Rose and then the LFs. Yeah. Okay, let's go ahead and jump in. But yeah, I, I can't in good faith recommend people summon on an ultra banner because the format is so bad. <laughs> Like, I don't know. The character can be as good as he as, as he wants. Like, this is a character that's probably in contention for top two in the game. Top one, potentially. We'll have to see after using him. Um, I don't... It doesn't, it doesn't change my opinion that the Ultra Banner format is terrible. All right, well, there's our first sparking, a Rose and a Zamasu. But obviously, I know that a lot of people are excited for this character, right? So I'm not going to take that away from anybody. So if you want to summon for Rosé and you like the way the character looks, you like the animations, you like the you, you like his kit or whatever, sure go for it. But for like a free player, I I don't I I just can't I can't in good faith recommend that people summon on this. All right. Green skies. Three pods. Let's see. I will say that, say though. Oh, we got instant transmission. I will say that this is definitely a better um, a better ultra banner than pretty much every other ultra banner we've ever gotten in terms of the, the the lineup here, for sure. That green Vegeta himself, he's definitely aged a bit. Like at this point, even after his Zenkai, that uh, green Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, but he's going to be a really really good Zenkai bench for this Ultra Rose. So I forgot to check the EX characters. Let me check what EX characters are on here. Okay. Let's see who we got here. If we go to Z Power List. Scroll down. Still only up to Thouser. Wow. That is really bad. I don't know why they're so insistent on limiting the amount of EXs available on these banners. It's not like you're going to pull them anyway. <laughs> it's like impossible to pull them. So, uh, whatever. All right. Show me something. Blue Skies. Oh. Okay, this this is good. Nimbus. So we got Nimbus, which is a guaranteed featured, so it's either gonna be it's either gonna be an LF or it's Rose. Okay. I do not give me Broly. No Broly. Okay. Let's see. I'm covering up the skip button so I don't like get spoiled here. Come on, show me that ultra orb flying in. First rotation. I always do so bad on Ultra Banners. Can we just get can can, can I just get relief once? Just a quick and painless first copy, please. No, don't. Okay, that wasn't why we got the, the Nimbus. No. Oh, no. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready for it. Okay. Yeah, that sucks. I was kind of hoping we'd just get a very quick and painless first copy out of the way, but... That doesn't look like it's going to be the case here. Uh, <laughs> yeah, ultra banners just are not are not it. Let's just skip this. Let's not do that. 
And now, because of the way that, this, that the uh, Legends ticket system works, I'm going to have my entire gift box just flooded by Legends tickets forever. Um, okay, now we're skipping this with the animation. All right, UL rates times two. Let's go. Clearly, UL rates times two is going to bless me here, right? You all rates times two? Three, three pods, green skies. Skip. <laughs> all right, another Goku Black and Zamasu. Yay. Uh, all right, give me something interesting. Red skies. Okay. All right, hold on. Another featured character, and it's red skies, not blue skies. And it's blue Goku. All right, Vegeta animation, go. Damn. All right, at least we didn't get Broly. That's good. All right, Goku, let's see it. Ultra, Ultra Rosé. Come on. Okay. The reason why I'm covering the skip button is because I know, obviously, if it's, if it's the Ultra Orb animation, it's going to be Rosé. But if it's a fake out, I don't want it to spoil me. Okay. This is... Why is it always the last character? No. No. <laughs> Wrong one. All right, well, what? Now we all we have left is the green Vegeta. We've pulled every LF except for... <laughs> Well, we pulled out every LF and then no, uh, no ultras, right? Uh, I'm just going to skip this. We got Blue Zamasu. I mean, it's a good pull for most players. Come on. All right, Blue Goku. Well, I guess we'll watch this one. Okay. We're winning, unfortunately. Skip that. All right. Fake me out here into an ultra. Another blue Zamasu. Okay. That, I mean, again, that is a really good pull for most players who don't have maxed out. Skip this. Ice Shenron, aren't sure. All right, two times rates. Clearly, this is going to be where we get him, right? Red Skies, Nimbus. I just Red Skies. Okay, hold on. No, it's Vegeta. This Vegeta always means you get terrible luck. All right. Uh, sure. Yep. I'm clinging on to my copium that we're going to still have a chance of pulling him here. Vegeta. <laughs> <laughs> I apologize. I was wrong. <laughs> the copium actually came through here. There he is. That was not bad at all. For copy number one, that is really, really not bad. All right, there we go. <laughs> First copy out of the way. We're looking pretty good. Uh, we, we got the... Uh, the legendary ultra fake out animation from a Vegeta animation that has never, ever gotten me anything good ever. <laughs> okay. We're going to start training him up just because I want to get this uh, out of the way here. Let's just do this and then we'll come back to that in a little bit. Um, so because this video is still under 10 minutes, we're going to go for a little bit longer. Maybe we'll do one more rotation, see if we can maybe get super, super lucky with one more copy. But I am, of course, content with pulling one here. Uh, Tau Green Skies. Oh, a another Vegeta, huh? Yeah, don't get carried away. I, 
Do not get carried away because we know this is going to be nothing. Yes. You had your once in 500,000, uh, a once every 500,000 opportunity where you actually got me the new character, but it's not going to happen multiple times in a row. It's not possible. Alrighty, so another. Oh, that's I thought that was the blues moth. It's the red one. Uh, okay, so we'll do this. I think we'll do this rotation, and then I think we might wrap up. We'll see. We will see because I want to. I want to get this uh, showcase out of the way here. Oh, this is blue skies though, so I'm a little bit hesitant. This is probably gonna be an LF, not an ultra. So let's see if we get Broly here. No, bro. and we're losing. Vegeta, okay. Hold on. My bets are on an LF, but you know, uh, maybe we're just getting insanely lucky here. Right. Come on. Show me something. Okay, it's gonna be the last unit again. It's an LF. Yeah. Alright, it's another trunks, damn. Wait, what? <laughs> what? Of course we had to pull this! We pulled two trunkses, huh? That was interesting. Alrighty, two times rates. I mean this we actually did pull them on the two times rate step. Uh so I'm not gonna hate on the two the two times rates right now. Space three pods. Okay. Space is definitely hit or miss. Could be a, either could go either way. Another instant okay, hold on. Instant transmission in space with the two times rate step. Hmm. Interesting. Is this gonna be anything? Maybe it's going to be nothing at all. Maybe it's actually nothing. <laughs> Literally just the guaranteed character. Wow, that was actually nothing. Okay. It kind of felt like it could be something, but you know, sometimes it's it's, it's, a, it's a bit misleading. All right, so we'll do this, and then I think we'll do the free multi, and then we'll go ahead and uh, jump out of this for a second. All right, three pods, green skies. We're not doing this. Another blue Zamasu. That's what, three blue Zamasus we've gotten already? Okay, <laughs> sure. Uh, all right, we'll make this the final multi of the video. Another green sky three pods. Let's get out of here. Double purple Google bug. Okay, sure. Sure, sure, sure. All right, so again, like I mentioned at the beginning of this video, I, I in good faith, I cannot tell you guys, you know, oh, Rosé is sick. Like, you, this is a must summon banner. Because the, like, looking at this from an objective standpoint, the actual format of ultra banners, they're just so bad that, like, I, I can't, I can't recommend that you guys actually summon on them. So I would say if you're somebody who's been looking forward to a potential Ultra Rosé for a while and you like the character of Rosé Goku Black and you like his kit and you think he will work with your team, then by all means, go ahead and summon. But from an objective standpoint, looking at the actual banner format of the Ultra Banners here, there's no way I can recommend for anybody to summon here. But the aesthetic of the banner, the way that they've changed, like the overall appearance of how this looks on the summon screen itself, I think it looks really nice. Um, a lot of clutter on the bottom, though, like there's a lot of just like stuff here. So I, I don't know, but I do think this looks good. Um, the banner is definitely better than a normal ultra banner because they have blue Zamasu. Some of the LFs on here are actually really good, like purple Rosé and then the um, the green Vegeta is a really good bench for this character. And then even blue Vegito, I think, is uh, actually he's, he's on here, right? The blue Vegito. Let me just see. Yeah, okay, we actually didn't pull this guy either, Blue Vegito. Um, Blue Vegito's a good bench. Vegeta's an inc incredible bench for Rosé. And then this guy's just a good unit in general. Trunks definitely has uh, been aged a little bit at this point, but overall, I think, uh, yeah, this banner, uh, off to a good start here for sure. Hope you guys enjoyed. Good luck on your summons, and I'll see you guys all in the next one.